Some call me Raven, the Dark Talon of Death. Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Black Talon here today. And today I'm gonna to be doing a beginner guide video for Shaheen in Tekken 8. Now, if you guys are new to Tekken 8 and you see this character on the character select screen, Shaheen, the Desert Falcon himself, and you think he looks really cool, I'm here to tell you as a Shaheen man and enthusiast myself that this character is freaking awesome. He's one of my main characters in the game, and I've mained him since Tekken 7 where he was first introduced. How can you not think this character is cool, man? He has the little outfit on, he's from Saudi Arabia. He does CQC, close quarters combat. How you guys think that's not freaking cool, man? And he has a heart of gold, man, as a character in the story mode. You can't get mad at that. In this video, I'm gonna go over essentially how you want to play the character when you're first starting out, the ranges you wanna play at, some beginner strats you want to use, his most important tools, of course, to use when you're playing them, and of course, at the end of the video, I'm going to show off some real-time gameplay footage of all that stuff being done in action online and ranked. Hopefully, this video will help you out. So, let's go ahead and start off with the kind of character archetype he is. Uh, Shaheen is going to be a character that you want to play kind of up close and personal in this range right here. Shaheen likes to stick to you. He likes to stick to his opponent, right? He doesn't like to be out here. He doesn't have to be out here dancing around and doing stuff like this. He likes to be kind of right here dancing and up close and personal. Right here. Poking him out, hitting him. His fighting style is close quarters combat. Not far quarters combat, close quarters combat. So you want to be up close and personal. So essentially what you want to do is, you know, you got stuff like his good jabs. He has really good jabs, right? You see that? He has really good jabs. His jabs reach far. He gets a bunch of stuff guaranteed on counter hit with his jabs. I mean, look at that. He can do the stuff like that. He has down four at one. His down four one's extremely good. And then of course, down three. You wanna use stuff like this. Not only is his poking really good, but guess what? His counter hits are really good as well. He's one of the characters in this game who has an 11 frame counter hit launcher. So you do stuff like this. Boom. Get the combo. Messed it up. But you guys get the idea, right? So he can counter hit with stuff like this. You know, he can catch you mashing. If he does his little string right here, delay it, catch a mashing. 4-1 as well. Go ahead and get that launcher, take him to the wall, do tons of damage. If you're looking to, of course, apply some pressure to the opponent up close, guess what? He can do that too. Back three is plus three on block. Mix that with your down four one, and you know, it's game time. Mix that with down three, down four one. Hell, mix that with your four one as well, get a clean counter hit. Now, the second thing you wanna do is gonna be this right here. Oh, look at this. That is the slide, okay? This is where the character also shines as well. He, uh, he shines up close with his extremely good poking game, but also his extremely good mix-up game as well. A mix-up is when you make your opponent guess between a high or a low. And guess what? Right here, you got the low slide, and you know what? If they duck, they get hit with the mid, and they get launched, and they take a bunch of damage. Stuff like that. So that's how you really wanna play the character, right? You wanna get in close and personal. You kinda wanna dance your way in a little bit. You know, he has approach tools like running two, plus on block, and it knocks down, does good damage. You know, he has really good whiff punishers as well. You know, he has his, his hop kick right here. One of his best whiff punishers out here in this range. Hop kick, you know, down back two one is one of his best whiff punishers. If you guys watch my videos, I use this move a lot. I love this move. Down back 2-1. It is the bread and butter. You got to use it. And it's hit confirmable. And you can, of course, dance your way in with your jabs as well. Fight your way in with your jabs. As you can see, you can kind of get in there as well. Do some sneak shenanigans. Get in there a little bit. So, yeah, man. This character has really good approach tools. And once he gets up close to personal, he is deadly. Great counter hits. And, of course great mix-ups as well. So, Shaheen is a character where you want to be up close with personal and you want to enforce his full crouch mix-up. So to access the slide, you want to be fully crouching. Now you are vulnerable in this state, so you got to be careful not to do it too much against really button-happy opponents. But once you get your opponent conditioned to block for a good amount of time, you know, it's stuff like this, down for a one, and then of course your counter hits. Once you get, it, once you get them conditioned to block with stuff like this, this is when you want to start sliding on him, man. You want to start sliding on him. Now, the really cool thing is you can access his full crouch in very sneaky and very unexpected ways, right? 
he has a lot of moves that put him in full crouch. So you don't have, you don't have, you don't have to like go up to your opponent and just duck in their face. That's kind of risky. Instead, you can go into full crouch off a lot of different ways, a lot of very sneaky ways that I'm gonna show you right now. So to go over a couple, you know, he has his down three. His down three is one of his best low pokes. Literally a key move, down three. As you can see here, you can go into full crouch from here. You can also go into full crouch from it, just doing it on hit, just like this. Full crouch right there. You see here? So, once you get them blocking that, you can slide on them. Other lows that you can do as well is of course side step two. Side step two puts him in full crouch automatically. And you guys know what that means, right? Slide on him. Start sliding on him. Watch this. Oh, hit him. Sorry, I messed it up. Boom, hit him. Then guess what? Slide on him. Guess what? Hit him. Guess what? Slide on him again. This is what you want to get. You want to get your opponent in this blender right here. Some other ways to get into full crouch as well is going to be, of course, his back one. His back one's a really good move. Really good way to space your opponent out in this range right here. As you can see here, it is zero on block. It's a really good move. You got to use this move. And as you guys can see, you have the option to go into full crouch if you hold down. And you guys know what that means, right? Slide on them slide on them but the cool thing is that's a whole mix up so i could go in a full crouch and if you duck and they duck guess what hit them with a mid and then slide on them again so this is where the character shines this is where he's at his strongest up close and personal poking you out and then once you get your opponent kind of conditioned to sit still for a little bit you can start threatening with this slide mix up right sometimes if your opponent's really conditioned you can even just do this duck in their face for a little bit, right? They might flinch and they might duck and guess what? They get launched. They get launched, man. Stuff like this. They get launched. You can't beat it. And then they take a million damage. Look at that. All because they ducked against the slide, man. They scared of the slide. The slide is one of his scariest moves because of the way he can loop it over and over and over over again it's really really effective all right guys and then that's gonna be my 10 minute guide video on shaheen in tekken 8 so if you're looking for a character who has a very simple game plan and a very strong game plan as well very simple and very effective and strong shaheen is that character man you want to definitely play him up close and personal like this you know side step down for one side step and then down for two to launch your opponent you want to check for jabs, and of course, you want to, of course, go for the slide mix-up. You want to slide on your opponent and kind of get them in this little loop right here. Like, look, isn't this cool? How y'all not like this character, man? He is freaking awesome. I do plan to do a more advanced guide in the future on the channel where I go over more advanced Shaheen strats that you want to do. Uh, that's going to be a more longer video because there's a lot of stuff with this character, a lot of stuff to show. And of course, I plan to go over some combo videos, make a combo video as well for the character. So if you guys are Shaheen players or Shaheen enjoyers or Shaheen enthusiasts, hey man, check the channel out, subscribe to the channel for more content in the future. And I of course plan to do my ranked grind series on the channel as well, where I go from um, all the way from the lowest rank all the way to Ganryu rank in this game, which is the red ranks. And with that being said, let's go ahead and check out some actual Shaheen gameplay. Some of this stuff being used in real time online against opponents, guys. Uh, check that gameplay out. Thanks for watching the video, guys, and have a great day and stay tuned for more.
was a sequence. I messed the combo up. I messed the combo up. Oh, that was a clean little sequence, bro. He mashed back too. Why like that? Don't do that. 